it's Doll Trick, and in today's episode of Push Play, which is a part of my daily series, A Trick A Day, we're going to take a look at adding MIDI effects to a track in live directly from Push. So let's get started. In the previous episode, we took a look at adding audio effects. So today, we're going to focus in on MIDI effects, and I've got some kind of Rhodes sound with a little bit of overdrive on it now. So let's take a listen to what we have in this clip. Cool, you can definitely hear the overdrive. <laughs> Great. What if I want to add a bit more variation to this by putting on a MIDI effect? Maybe arpeggiator, since that's one of my favorite MIDI effects. I can head over here to the top right of live, uh, top right of push, excuse me, <laughs> and click on the add device button from push itself. So let's go ahead and press on that. And now, instead of scrolling down to the audio effects category like we previously did, as well as the instruments category in a previous video, we're going to take a look at MIDI effects. And over here, when I'm over in the second column, I can use the knob to select the type of MIDI effect that I want to choose. So I've got arpeggiator all the way at the top since it starts with A and these are organized in alphabetical order. Once I've got that selected, I can go ahead and head over to the bottom right of the LED screen and there is a button that says load. So let's go ahead and press that button to load the arpeggiator up. And you'll notice that in my sequence of devices, the arpeggiator, since it's a MIDI device, appears before the instrument. So now let's take a listen to our distorted electric piano. Nice. And of course we can keep tweaking our parameters using the knobs. And that's exactly how you would put on a MIDI effect onto a track in live from Push. And just keep in mind that it always appears before an instrument and then audio effects appear after the instrument. But that's the trick for today. If you enjoyed this trick, please like, comment, share, subscribe. And you can also turn on the notification bell to be notified of whenever I have a new trick ready to share with all of you. Thanks so much for watching as always and see you soon. Bell trick.